It's lovely to have you here at the Noah premiere. You're looking forward to the film tonight. I'm so, so excited. I'm a massive fan of Darren Aronofsky and of Emma Watson and of Douglas Booth, so I can't wait to see this film. What fans want to know, what are you wearing tonight, clothes and makeup wise? Um, I'm wearing Burberry. The dress is from Burberry, the belt is from Burberry, um, the shoes are Christian Louboutin, and the ring is from a really cool jewelry brand. <clears throat> Sorry. I have a frog in my throat. The ring is from a jewelry brand called My Flash Trash, which is like really cool, like cocktail rings, and I love it. It's like spiky. I really like it. You mentioned that Emma Watson, one of the stars of the film tonight. Um, what do you think of the Emma Watson look? Because I mean, obviously in this film she's wearing very natural, kind of minimal makeup. But in real life, she tends to go for quite striking looks, doesn't she? I think Emma Watson always gets her makeup look perfect. I love her strong orange lip that she wore I think it was to the New York premiere of Noah and I'm just really excited to see her playing a character that's really kind of with a really stripped down look and natural and I think it's going to be quite an emotional film so I'm really looking forward to that. I think to get a natural makeup look you really need to buff it into your skin and really take time so people think oh a natural makeup look would just take five minutes because you're hardly putting anything on but really you could spend a really long time like buffing tinted moisturizer into your skin and um, nice highlighter under the eyes and um, yeah. What about people who say well I've got a, a tendency to have blemishes and things like that maybe the natural look isn't for me what would you say to people who kind of feel a bit insecure about going au naturel? Um, I think as long as you're concealing your blemishes, I mean, using something like Laura Mercier Secret Camouflage, you can get that looking really flawless on the skin. I think that you still need to have the full coverage on the blemishes, but then on the piece of your skin where it's nice, don't overdo it. See, last time we spoke to you, you were about to go off to Orlando to meet fans out there. How did that go? Yeah, I absolutely loved it. I loved um, Playlist Live. It was so much fun. And I can't wait for the next um, thing where it's like a fan meet and greet, which is going to be... Oh, uh, my products are launching into Superdrug on April the 9th. I think Emma Watson just arrived. Um, yeah. Oh my god. It's either people screaming for Emma Watson or because of the good news that your products are going to be in Superdrug. One of the I don't think it's for me. Um, yes, they're going into Superdrug in store on April the 9th, which is so exciting. And I'm going to be doing a big meet and greet in the store. I think around between the 9th and the 30th of April at some point, I'm going to be doing a big meet and greet.